How are you doing? What the hell do you care? Just asking, Bill. You want to know? I'll tell you. You're looking at a man who tonight is not walking through the valley of the shadow of death. He's galloping into it. At the same time, the business he built with his own hands and his own head has been accommodated by a couple of cheap pirates. And, um... Oh, yes, I almost forgot. My daughter's fallen in love with death. And I'm in love with your daughter. Say again. I'm in love with your daughter, and I'm taking her with me tonight. You what? I think you heard me, Bill. You're not taking Susan anyway. What the hell does that mean anyway? I thought we had a deal. And I'm sorry. Susan's my daughter. She has a wonderful life ahead of her. You're going to deprive her of it, and you're telling me you're sorry? Well, I'm sorry. Apology not accepted. I don't care, Bill. I love her. I'm perfect for you. To take whatever you want because it pleases you. It's not love. What is it? Some aimless infatuation in which, for the moment, you feel like indulging. It's missing everything that matters. Which is what? Trust, responsibility, taking the weight for your choices and feelings and spending the rest of your life living up to them, and above all, not hurting the object of your love. So that's what love is, according to William Paris? Multiply it by infinity and take it to the depth of forever, and you will still have barely a glimpse of what I'm talking about. Those were my words. They're mine now. Bill, Susan wants to come with me. She loves me. She loves you? Hmm? Who is you? Did you tell her who you are? No. Does she know where she's going? Hmm? See, Susan went of whatever way she did for that poor son of a bitch whose body you took and everything else since has been aftermath. You say you love her, but you don't know what love is. She loves you, but she doesn't know who you are. You make a deal, you're breaking it. Bottom line is, Joe, you're swindling her soul and you're doing it with your eyes wide open. I don't like what you're saying. I'm past caring what you like and what you don't like. You're stealing my daughter and I'm not gonna let you. You're not gonna let me? No, I'm not gonna let you. Are you threatening me? Yeah, I certainly hope so. Yeah. I loved Susan from the moment she was born, and I love her now, and every minute in between. And what I dream of is a man who will discover her, and that she will discover a man who will love her, who is worthy of her, who is of this world, of this time, and has the grace and compassion and fortitude to walk beside her as she makes her way through this beautiful thing called life. Enough! What I know is what I want, and what I want is Susan. And I will have her, and she will have me, and that's the way it's going to be. And there's nothing you can do about it. Why did you come in here and tell me all this, Joe? I mean, you're the big shot, you're the biggest shot of all. You don't have to ask my permission, but that's what you're doing. Do you know why? Because you've somewhere, somehow, developed into a good guy, and you know this is all wrong. I don't know what you're going to do, but... Uh, how can this be love? She doesn't know who you are. Why didn't you tell her? Try it out on her. See what happens. Reveal everything there is to know about yourself, and let the chips fall where they may. Okay? I've given it my best shot. I, uh... I wish I could tell you to sleep on it. 